Hi, my name is Alex Life, and I work with Docker's DevRel team. In this video, I want to show you the practical example of Docker and E2B partnership around AI sandboxes. E2B is a startup and they provide the service where you can, through API, create isolated sandboxes running in the cloud. So when you run code that AI generates, it can safely run in an isolated, secure environment. I'm going to show you how you can use Docker MCP catalog and the MCP servers that that provides within the sandboxes that E2B gives you. So first of all, you need to get the access to E2B. You can sign up for the account, create your API keys. You put them in your environment variables, and then we're going to look at this open source repository. In this example, we're going to configure cloud code running in an E2B sandbox, and we're going to use GitHub MCP server to access our repositories and a Notion MCP server to store the findings about the repositories. Here I have that project. We configure our services that we're going to use called code, which we're going to use with the Entropic API key Notion with the Notion integration token and GitHub with a token as well. In the few lines of code, you can through API configure which MCP servers you would like to use within your sandbox. The same with the E2B API, you can create and manage the life cycle of your sandbox. Note, we're passing the MCP servers so you can enable them via configuration. After that, we are ready to run the commands. So the first thing we do, we will run the cloud MCP add command connecting cloud running in the sandbox. We're going to connect that cloud code to the MCP toolkit running in the sandbox. And then we can run the command. We're going to use the GitHub to list my repositories and summarize the top three repositories in a Notion page. We're on Cloud. We don't want to have any permissions because Cloud is safely running in the isolated environment. We pass the task into the prompt. After that, we just we have to wait for the results. So in my repository here, I can do UV run main. It will start churning at our things. So the first thing that it shows me, it gives me the URL and the, this application prints me the URL for the MCP gateway and also the authorization header that I need to use if I want to connect. While I'm going to run the model context protocol inspector and it will open the inspector for me. I'm going to say I want to connect via streamable HTTP and put that link in the configuration. And then I will set up the authorization token as well. And I will copy the value that the API provided me with. So this will make my inspector here connect to my cloud instance running in the sandbox. And I can list the tools and I can see whether I configured everything correctly or not. And I can say, for example, GitHub user get official me. So run this command and check that it succeeds. It does find me and my login at GitHub, which we configured via the GitHub token. So it does work pretty well. Now, back at our command line console, here's what it tells us. Okay, they completed the task. Here's my repositories and the content is in that Notion page. So we can see that, that it works. And this is how you get the sandbox running in the E2B environment, run MCP gateway there, connect that with the tools from the MCP catalog by Docker, and you can use your AI assistance with those tools at hand. Thank <laughs> you.